We just finished catching bait and I want to show, show you a cool little tool that uh, we use when we're retrieving our anchor. I always drive ahead of the anchor anyway, but it's called an anchor ball retrieval. And uh, Chad's going to demonstrate it for us and show you how it's done. So we have the clevis, which you can put your rope into. And then you got your float, which pulls the anchor off the bottom. Just drop the clevis on the rope. Don't forget to clamp it. Otherwise, you'll be buying another one. And then you just put it in the drink. And as he drives, it'll go down the rope and lift that anchor up. Just retrieve the uh, anchor on the surface of the water rather than pulling against all that surface weight or the bottom. Now that is a really cool trick, especially if you're uh, if you don't have a spot lock trolling motor or if you're an offshore guy. That that trick with the anchor ball retrievals is pretty cool. That's actually the first time I've used it. Chad's used it in the past on some offshore boats, and he was like, "Wait until you see how easy it is." And so easy Especially, a fat boy can do it. Yeah, so it's so easy that he can do it. And uh, I know that he was tired of pulling the anchor in the past, but if we ever have the circumstances where our batteries die or something happens with the trolling motor, we can still utilize that anchor ball retrieval system to make it so much easier. And I know offshore guys actually will drive with it yep. like a mile or two, and then when they get to the spot, they'll, they'll slack it off and the anchor will drop down and they can get pretty precise with their anchoring. So it's pretty cool.